Hey there foodies and welcome to another food review. This is a a different day. <laughs> Normally I do it on Saturdays but today is the 26th, excuse me, today is the 26th of Jan. Republic Day so I have the day off. I've been enjoying a quiet day at home of course. I don't do much. Uh, I don't go out much um, these days so I decided to just spend it at home. Excuse me. I am drinking a wheat beer. Um, well, it's it's the grasshopper. I'm sorry, it's the <laughs> grasshopper. It's the woodpecker. I guess it's a wheat beer. Yeah, it is a wood uh, wood. So it's called the woodpecker wheat beer. I've done a review of it earlier. This is one of my favorite beers um, since I started having it a little while ago. I think about a couple of years ago. Uh, haven't had it in a while. I think uh, the last time I had it is almost over a year ago. But so during COVID, I wasn't getting much beer. Um, and I mean, during the initial lockdown stages, I didn't have much beer until the um, until things kind of sorted sorted out themselves by end of December of 2020. Things are a little bit more easier to get, um, but still not the way that it was. <laughs> anyway, we're not doing a review of the beer, but yeah, it is a lovely beer. I've been missing it. Um, and now I have more of chances of having it. Uh, so we got two of those. All right. So shawarma, chicken shawarma with tahini sauce. Finally, I'm getting some tahini sauce. It's an added option, unfortunately, for these guys. So if you do want it, uh, it's 20 bucks extra. But I think the chicken shawarma is around 170 rupees. Uh, it looks like a burrito. It looks, <laughs> it looks an absolute mess, right? So this is from Haji Ibrahim. Uh, I've been hearing about this place in a while. I think they've got two, maybe three outlets. A lot of these local places have, once they get success, uh, once they become successful, they have a few outlets here and there. Um, the So I ordered three, one for dad, one for mom, one for myself. And I had some french fries on the side because I knew the, uh, the shawarma on its own wouldn't be enough. But um, yeah, we love shawarma. So let's try some french fries. This is the first time I'm having anything from this restaurant. Once again, Haji Ibrahim, that's the name of the place. They got shawarma with mayo, shawarma with cheese. I can't think of shawarma with cheese, but yeah, they do have it. Shawarma with mayo is very common over here. Fried fries are okay. I'm going to guess they are more store-bought stuff. The uh, frozen kind. I got some pickles and some carrot. Pickle carrot. I love carrots. And I love pickle carrots. So let's try the shawarma. Nicely wrapped. Excuse me, don't look at my messy bed. I'm going to take a nice big bite. Let's see how it tastes like. Yeah, pretty good. I love the tahini sauce taste. It's kind of rare to get tahini sauce shawarmas over here, at least as far as I'm concerned. That's pretty good. I wish it was a little bit more bigger because it's absolutely lovely. Here's a cross section of it. So I can see a lot of chicken. Maybe some tomatoes, some onions. Oh yeah, there's mostly chicken in this. It says it's the whole chicken shawarma. I'll put that in the title as well. Pretty good. Um, it is a little far away, so it's not cold, but it has lost the heat. Um, so if it was a little bit more fresher, hotter, I'm pretty sure it would have been even even more awesome. It's a pretty good shawarma, let me tell you that. Could give it a 9 out of 10. I think it's better, probably one of the better shawarmas that I've had so far. I usually get shawarma from two or three places. I think two places mostly. And the third is a another branch of that same outlet, but this one. 
is much more better. I'm going to give it a 9. Thank you guys. Bye.